A jury is recommending that criminal charges be filed on the death of a black man who died in the Milwaukee County Jail last year. 38-year-old Terrell Thomas died in April of last year after being deprived of water for seven consecutive days at the Milwaukee County Jail, which is run by the controversial Sheriff David A. Clark Jr. Prosecutors say Thomas was unable to communicate his needs because he had bipolar disease. Following an inquest into the incident, a jury found probable cause of crime in Thomas's death involving a major and lieutenant at the jail, as well as five corrections officers. It is now up to the Milwaukee District Attorney John Chisholm to decide if any criminal charges will be actually filed against the jail off officials. Chisholm did not comment on whether Sheriff Clark will face any charges, and no shock. Cheryl Clark, who has lots to say about, about Black Lives Matter, lots to say about Donald Trump, lots to say about anything else, is amazingly quiet on this story. Come on, Sheriff Clark, buck up in your big cowboy hat and be a man and talk about how this man died in your jail, along with three other people who died in your jail. But you're supposed to be the straight shooter. You're right. A peaceful protest turned deadly. 37-year-old black man was shot and killed by Baton Rouge police. His hands are in the air, and you still get shot by the cops. Oh, my God, please don't tell me he's dead. We're not going to let hate define us. Race is a big part of this. If truly all lives matter, then all lives need to matter equally. What we require is action. What we require is accountability. We understand that black lives do matter. We will keep focus on this issue. News One Now, every weekday morning at 7 on TV One.